Hey, what up fam? It's your boy Swift and we are back with some more legends. So, with Zamasu recently getting a Zenkai and I also recently got um, God Topo to Red 2, uh, I really wanted to try out this more offensive God Key team. There's still Clapku, but I think of everything other than Clapku is kind of a more offensive setup. So yeah, let's jump in. All right, first match going up against a God Key team. He actually brings Beerus, which is another setup that I want to try out. Um, maybe using Beerus alongside Zenkai Zamasu, but... Okay, got him in the sidestep. But uh, for this video, we're, we're rocking with Topo. And I might not bring Topo to every single match. It's really, you know, only when I need a green unit, um, I'll bring him. Uh, I don't know why I thought I might be able to get my Vanish back right there. There's no way he has a rush already. Then again, it is Dragon Ball Legends, so you never know. Okay, he does not sidestep. Okay, very nice single tap. Gotta give the man props for that one. Okay, he actually might have a rush at this point. Okay, maybe not. Okay, got him with that blue. That's some good damage. Okay. Let's go ahead and do this. That's fine. Of course, he seals my ultimate. Uh, that's really unlucky. Well, got the last Dragon Ball. I think I'm going to just pop the rush. If he wants to sack off Champa, that's fine. I definitely agree with him sacking off Champa, but it just makes things easier for me. Don't have to worry about a yellow unit anymore, so. That only did 2.7 million, though. Okay, got him here. Let's go into Vegeta, pop the main. Ooh, that might be a dead Beerus. Actually, I'm pretty sure that is a dead Beerus. Gotta love that blast armor, man. And that right there is a perfect example of why having blast armor on an ultimate is so powerful. Because you can pop the main ability, you know, it's a time stop. And then if you see them going for that blast, you are, you know, just good to go. As long as you're at mid range or the timing is right. Um, but yeah, that, that right there is why blast armor is so nice to have. Okay, I think as long as I play patiently here, there's really no way he can come back. That's fine. Oof, that's a lot of damage, but that's fine. Okay. No, sir. And that is example. That is an example of why not having blast armor kind of sucks. Um. Obviously, Zamasu did not have Blast Armor ever on that ultimate, but, you know, that would have been cool if they gave him that with the Zenkai, but I can understand why they didn't. Really wish I had a Strike card right there. That's fine. Worst comes to worst, I can just sack off Topo. Okay, I think this should be game. Some really good damage from Zamasu. And you gotta love that card draw speed, man. God, I really do love Zenkai Zamasu. I think he is uh, phenomenal. Very, very good Zenkai. Alright, we got a kind of a blue-blue-purple Super Saiyan setup. I did not want to start with Topo because that actually wastes one of his lock-ins. He only has a limited amount of lock-ins and I don't really like starting with Topo because you just waste one of them. Kind of the same thing as starting with Zenkai Boo, even though a lot of people still start with Boo just for the uh, strike seal. 
But, yeah, normally I don't want to waste a lock-in. Okay, got him here. Let's do this. If he swaps out, we'll just draw another card. Yep, that's fine. God, Namagoku is still so good. I mean, he's really tanky, too. I've seen Namagoku tank rushes before. Especially when he's got that damage cut. Okay. And he's locked in. Pretty sure this is going to kill. Uh, we destroyed two cards, so we do have that boosted damage. And this right here is a perfect example of why Topo's lock-in is phenomenal, man. Look at that, dude. Just one-shotted a Namek Goku. He was locked in. He literally could not do anything. Um, because if I didn't have Topo's lock-in right there, I would have had to use my rush. But just the fact I was able to get rid of Namek Goku without having to even use my rush, it, it just it's just so good. Um, and I think now that I have Topo Red 2, I will be using him a lot more. Because that's what I've been waiting on this whole time, is I've just been dumping Z-Power into him. And I still think, when I get Topo to 14 stars, man, he is going to be a beast. Okay. That is going to be game. Let's uh, jump into the next one. Alright, we got another God Key team. You love to see it. This guy's got a, actually a pretty good god key setup. We both start with Vegeta. Okay, that's fine. Let's actually force him to swap out here. I did not have to do that, but sometimes if you can force the swap, it's actually a good thing. should I do here? Should I tackle? No. Okay, let's backflip. Free priority. I'll take it. Is he going to try to go to Vegeta? Oh, no, he's not. Okay. Ooh, nice timing. Nice timing. Okay, he goes for a full screen. I guess he thought I was at mid-range, but by the time he clicked the strike card, I was already floating back to long range. So that actually worked out pretty well. Um, I think I could rush right here, and if he went to clap coup, it would actually be validated because I would get the, uh, I would reduce his Dragon Balls or whatever, but I think I'm going to save my rush. But in that situation, you could rush with Vegeta. And it would still make sense. But unless I can land my rush on somebody, I can already tell this is probably going to be a long game. He's got Vados too, so he's got the healing on his side. I have a little bit of healing, but not much. All three units on my team heal themselves, but there's no team support. Which is fine. Like I said, this is kind of a more offensive God Key team, other, other than Clapku. Obviously, Clapku is kind of the defense of the team. Please don't have a blue card. Okay. I have no key, dude. Ah, I could have stopped him. Oh, he's going to rush right there. That's actually fine. We'll go to Zamasu. I know for a fact this is not going to kill Zamasu. Um, I've played with Vados enough times to, to know that she does not have the damage output to get the kill right here. And Zamasu is one tanky boy, man. Yeah, there's, there's no way this kills. It didn't even do 50% of his health. Okay. Dude, no. Oh, I actually still won. Okay. I was going to say, I don't know why, man. My clashes are just not on point right now. Once again, I could rush, but I don't really want to just yet. Let's 
Ooh. Okay, I'll take it. And I think finally we can get rid of the revival. I'll just use my ultimate. That's fine. And basically now, the next time I get priority, I'm good to rush. So, hopefully, as long as I don't make too many mistakes, I think I should be able to um, win this match pretty easily. I just got to gain priority one more time. Pop the rush, and I should be good. But, I mean, this guy could easily come back. I wouldn't really say that I have the advantage just yet. Ooh, he actually went for an instant vanish. I, I did not expect that. I thought he would be patient right there. All right, let's soak up as much of this damage with Clapku as I can, and then if he goes to pop the ultimate, I'll probably just go to Vegeta because I do not want him reducing my Dragon Balls. So yeah, yeah, this is gonna do a lot of damage. It's gonna hurt, but I don't think it's gonna kill. Okay. Okay, got him in the side set. Let's just launch the second one. Luckily, I didn't sidestep right there. Let's go for taps. I have to be extremely careful with Vegeta right now. No, I should have just went for another vanish. Okay, yeah, now he definitely has a chance to come back. I have to I have to play really well here. But like I said, I just have to gain priority, and then I'm good to rush. Okay, yep. Let's see what he does here. I, I'm basically just good to rush, though. I think I'm just going to pop it. I need to get as much damage dealt as I can right now as well, because there's a possibility this goes down to timer count. Hopefully I can finish the match before then, but... There's only 30 seconds left, so... The more damage, the better right now. Hey, got him with the swift single tap, baby. Let's go. Okay. No. No, that's not good. Okay, I got excited way too quickly. This guy could easily win. If I can catch him in the sidestep. Ooh, perfect. Okay, I'm not even going to sidestep. Not even going to charge step. I don't think he has time to swap out. If I can get the kill. Nice. Okay. As long as I don't let Zamasu die, then this should be game. If I can land this blue card, maybe. No. Let me let me cancel. Let me cancel. Okay. Ooh. Let me charge step. Oh my god. Dude, thank god. Oh my dude, for some reason it didn't let me charge step right there. And I know for a fact I should have been able to. That was really weird. Alright, going up against a Saiyan team. Oh, okay, okay. This guy knows what he's doing. He's not going to drop combo, though. Let's try to sneak in some Asu. Okay, I'll take it. I could have stayed in with Zamasu right there and not wasted the vanish, but I don't think it's a big deal. Dude, oh. If I wouldn't have sec if I wouldn't have delayed that second sidestep, I, I would have been able to vanish that. But I'm just so used to like if I do do a double sidestep, I usually try to delay the second one. Oh, yeah, I didn't think he'd have another card right there. 
Oh, okay, I should be able to do... Oh my god, I could have gotten out of that. I could have gotten out of that. But I clicked right above Zamasu's head. Or right above Zamasu's picture. Like, I was trying to go to Zamasu so I could, so I could vanish out of that rush. And I literally tapped, like, right above Zamasu's icon. That sucks. I mean, that's not the end of the world, though, because he wasted his rush on Klaku's first life, so... I think I still have kind of the advantage at this point, as long as I can land my rush. Okay, I gotta stop tackling. This guy knows what's up. But, I mean, this is not a good start for me, but... Like I said, the fact he used his rush on Klaku, I think, will help me out in the long run. As long as I can land my rush. Okay, let me focus up, because I'm, for whatever reason, I'm kind of playing like crap. Okay, that's fine. We can go to Klapku. He can tank. And then we can start healing with the main ability. I think I can come back. Like I said, I just have to make sure I land my rush. Okay. Let's go to Vegeta. Pop the main. That way, I'm immune to cover change. And we'll just pop the rush immediately. Oh, he gives me Super Saiyan 3. I mean, I, I think what happened was he just forgot that um, Vegeta is immune to cover changes after he pops his main ability. So this is actually huge. This is definitely very, very good. As long as it kills, thank you. All right, now I think I definitely have the advantage. Let's go tight neutral. Ooh, that's some really good damage. God, I can't wait to get uh, Evolution Vegeta up to 7 stars. I'm literally 100 Z power away, so as soon as I can get one of those 100 Z powers in the shop, uh, I will get him up to 7. Ooh, for whatever reason, I thought he would wait for me to sidestep. But this is fine. Zamasu can tank. I'd rather go to Zamasu here than let Klapku die. Kind of interested to see how well Zamasu can tank this, too. I mean, that's a lot of damage, but considering we're at type disadvantage right there, that, that was decent tanking. The single tap has backfired. Okay, got him in the sidestep. And I think at this point, I should be good. Sidestep for me. Thank you, thank you. That is going to be game. We'll pop this, pop the ultimate. And we'll end off in some style. <laughs> Alright, I think we got time for one more match. So, let's go ahead and jump into the next one. Alright, we got a Fusions team. I didn't really have to bring Topo, but I wanted to bring him just to... I want to keep playing with this guy, especially now that I got him red too. Okay, got him with the mid-range tackle tech. Let's go to Topo, lock him in. And he's going to go to Gogeta, but that's fine. Nothing I can do about that. He only has one more cover save with Gogeta, though. Thank God they only gave Gogeta um, two uses on that cover change. Because, man, if that cover change had unlimited uses, it would be so aggravating. Okay, Zamasu's actually tanking this really well. I mean, when you consider how much damage the Zenkai Red Gogeta does. He's going to use his main ability already, really? I'll just let Zamasu take it. It's going to hurt, but there's no way it kills. And we can heal back a lot of this damage. He might have a blue card. I'm just going to pop a strike. Okay. 
I didn't want to pop a blast card and then just get hit with the blue and lose Zamasu, so full screen strike actually worked out pretty well right there. Okay, I'll take it. Let's lock him in. And we're just going to rush. Okay, he gives me Gogeta blue. That's cool, that's cool. God, look at that damage output. One thing about God Topo, man, is, is he does some really good blast damage. I had a feeling he was going to try and rush right there. So, nice. Now we don't have to worry about his rush. Oh, but that's sealed. That's not good. Okay, perfect. I needed that just to waste a little bit of time. Now we can swap out. Ooh, got him. That's huge. Okay, I think I'm just going to pop my main, pop the ultimate. If he wants to go to Gogeta, that's fine with me. Okay, he does. I don't think this is going to kill, but it's going to do some really good damage. No, I, I wanted to click the blast card. I don't even know why I clicked the strike. I mean, he already used his rush, though, so... I don't have to worry about a rush. And we'll go to Vegeta. Because we can heal back up a little bit with that green. I mean, if he still had his rush right now, I think he would have a chance, but just the fact he already wasted his rush, I, I don't see him coming back from this. Ooh, that was, that was actually a nice play. Okay, dead Gogeta. Oh my god, my clashes are horrible right now. Absolutely horrible. Okay, I heard that sidestep. This is going to be game. Oof. GG's. So, I think that will be the last match of the video. In conclusion, I do really, really like this offensive God Key setup. As you guys know, I use Vados a lot, so it's kind of refreshing to, to have a different style God Key team. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.